to watch the latest from India Science, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and press on the bell icon to get notifications on all the science related videos. about the universe is mysterious. Scientists have been trying to demystify these mysteries one step at a time. And they have made an interesting observation, one that has taken the world by storm. Our second story also has something to do with the cosmos. It talks about life, death and galaxies. Intrigued? Hello, Namaskar. I am Bhagishri and let's begin with today's episode of SciTech. Muons, which are smaller than atoms, were in the news after scientists found that these particles are more magnetic than expected. The finding, if confirmed, could alter our understanding of the universe. So what are muons and why are scientists interested in uncovering their properties? Find out in our video. Muons are fundamental particles present in the universe. Fundamental particles are ingredients of the universe. 31 fundamental particles are known to science. Muons are classified under leptons, whose name is derived from a Greek term leptos, which means small, fine or thin. Leptons are grouped into six particles. Electron, muon, tau, electron neutrino, muon neutrino and tau neutrino. Leptons and another group called quarks make up the building blocks of the universe. Weighing 207 times as much as electrons, muons are described as the heavier cousins of electrons. They are short-lived and unstable, existing only for 2.2 microseconds before breaking down into an electron and two kinds of neutrinos. Muons form in the upper parts of the atmosphere when cosmic rays, high-energy protons, bombard with atomic nuclei in the air. Let's now look at why scientists are interested in muons. These subatomic particles move with other fundamental particles like protons and neutrons. They could be interacting with undiscovered particles that can explain the elusive dark matter, which accounts for 85% of the matter in the universe. Muons act like they possess an internal magnet. In a high magnetic field, the direction of the muon's magnet wobbles. The speed of wobble depends on whether the muons interact with other subatomic particles. In other words, these interactions could either speed up or slow down the wobble. The standard model of particle physics describes the behavior of muons and other subatomic particles. It is in fact a well-established theory. But results from an experiment conducted in the US Department of Energy's Fermi National Accelerator Laboratory is challenging the standard model of particle physics. They found that muons are more magnetic than thought. Rene Fatemi, a physicist at the University of Kentucky who was involved in the study said, this quantity we measure reflects the interactions of the muon with everything else in the universe. But when the theorists calculate the same quantity using all of the known forces and particles in the standard model, we don't get the same answer. This is strong evidence that muon is sensitive to something that is not in our best theory. These results are not conclusive yet. The researchers say there is about one chance in 40,000 that the results are a fluke. Further analysis will uncover more details about the muons. NASA's Hubble telescope recently snapped a picture of a dying galaxy. You heard it right, a dying galaxy. 
life and death are not restricted to life on earth alone galaxies also go through the same watch our video to learn how and why galaxies die galaxies are born they breathe and they die after the big bang the universe was flooded with hydrogen gas predominantly gravity pulled the gas together forming clouds which then gave birth to galaxies and stars stars burn the gas as fuel when they run out of fuel they die in a dramatic explosion called a supernova and some of these dying stellar bodies expel the gas into the galaxy then gravity pulls the expelled gas to form new galaxies and stars in that order the process keeps repeating itself like a cycle now how do galaxies die galaxies meet their end when they run out of gas according to one study gases stop falling back into the galaxy there are other theories too some researchers think bigger galaxies strip gases sitting in the space between stars of smaller satellite galaxies when galaxies have exhausted their gas reserves star formation comes to a halt recently the hubble telescope captured an image of one such dying galaxy named ngc 1947 which is about 40 million light years away ngc 1947 is a lenticular galaxy it shares features with spiral galaxies like the milky way and elliptical galaxies like cygnus a about 600 million light years away from earth now you might wonder whether our milky way is closer to death currently the rate of star formation in our home galaxy is slow however this does not mean the milky way has exhausted all its options researchers suspect it could consume magellanic clouds two dwarf galaxies orbiting the milky way It is predicted to merge with a neighboring Andromeda galaxy in a few billion years. This event could combine the unspent gas from both galaxies, sowing the seeds for new stars. Well, that's all for this episode of SciTech. You can send us your valuable feedback on the email ID flashing on your screens. Also download India Science app or visit our website www.indiascience.in for more such videos. Don't forget to follow us on our social media handles as well. Before signing off, here is fact of the day for you. Muons were first discovered in 1936 by Carl D. Anderson and Seth Neddermeyer. 